All right, for sale. There's a lot of nice stuff there, but uh, the lady said she looked every single thing. Oh, <laughs> there was like thousands of things, so she was busy. Um, we bought this George Briard tray um, for five dollars. We spent fifteen total, and the George Briard tray. What do you think it's worth? I don't know. It should be. Hopefully, it's worth at least twenty-five or so. Um, and then I bought these. They're, I, I don't know exactly what they're worth, but I think they're worth about 20-ish a piece. So for the two, and this should be an easy thing for me to deal with. Um, I got two of these, and they came with a nice um, sacks. Put them in a sack. Um, they're wine caddies, or wine coasters. I don't know what you call it, you know. So you put the wine bottle in there, and it, it makes it a little harder to knock it over. I think they're probably aluminum. And here's what the label says. Let me just focus in on that. Mariposa. And Marie, you said they said it was made in Mexico. Um, but they're, they're heavy enough. The design is nice. I looked up Sunflower on them, and I couldn't find them. But my personal feeling is they're worth 20 to 25 a piece. So... At 10 for the two, I think I should be able to get at least 40, uh, which is kind of like maybe around $20 profit is what I'm hoping. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll check, and if if uh, they sell for more, I'll, I'll let you guys know. I don't have a lot of time. Uh, paid 100 for this box and we bought it. Spent 100 on jewelry. These are these uh, very fragile glass Christmas trees. They're really cool. Sometimes they come with ornaments like this one. She said that she had seen the ornaments, but she couldn't find them. So I didn't get them. But I had the big ones. The big ones sell for over 100 Like I said, I spent 100 for everything. This one ought to be, like with the, all those cool little ornaments, that ought to be like 30 by itself, I'm hoping. Um, the smaller ones don't sell for as much money. I bought this big brass owl. Uh, it's pretty cool. Made in Korea. They like that made in Korea um, brass sculptural stuff. Uh, oh, here. This is like an Eskimo, an Inuit kind of owl. Again, I paid 100 for everything. This is a good piece of glass. This ought to be worth like 30 or more. This is like, I think they call it, it's probably Fenton Coin Dot. Um, here's a, a really nice stick pin holder with some BS stick pins. I'm lucky this one's gold or something. Hey, you want to look at these stick pins? Yeah. That are in the here. I'll just pass you the old stick pin holder. I so don't want to talk about that. Uh, let's see. Oh, I got two of these. This is a uh, imperial glass salt and pepper. I'm hoping they're worth at least twenty-five or more for the pair. Kind of nice carnival. Um, this is some kind of. I don't know if it's a shade or something. But it's hollow. It's glass. I thought I broke it. And it is carnival. And I guess it's amethyst. Not too white. Uh, yeah, it's black. It's purple. Okay. Uh, then I got a Fenton Bell. Nice one. This ought to be worth 25 or so. Maybe more. You know, I'm not always up on prices for everything. There's nothing in there. Oh, and then I got this owl. This should be worth 25 30 at least. I think for 100 it's okay. I would have liked to pay less, as always. But I think overall I probably did okay today. I'm just going to put some of the stuff in the box, but that's it. That's everything I got. Oh, and I'm, I'll show Marie's jewelry in a minute. Show me what she got. I got two scarab. That's probably gold filled with some sterling. Nice. This, this was so cool. You basically paid 100 for your jewelry. She did like, hey, fill a bag for 100 <laughs> But it, it wasn't a real bag, right? Because did she have a bag? No. Yeah, so she no, just... I thought that pin was. Yeah, this one's really nice. Who makes it? Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't say. But I would guess it's like 60s. Yeah. I got this Just from set. the brush way it is on it's, the back. It's West Germany. Uh, it's plastic, but it's like textured. Okay. Yeah, I see. It's got like those little beads. Micro beads. And that's like tin, I guess. I think it's tin or steel. It's like a thin sheet, but it's metal for sure. Yeah. And it's like cut. But I can't find the other one right now. I got this set. It's earrings. Okay, this is fun. Anybody? I don't know. 
It's not selling, no. Okay, and so this is like probably 20 ish dollars. 25. Okay. Uh, you don't, don't give me one yeah. I know, I said okay. I can't find the other one yet. Yeah, this is pretty. Hopefully, I got it. I better make sure it's in here. Sure, it is. This has like. Like oh, you said, pink is. rhinestones. Okay, there's the other earring. So you got it. This is a set. And that's nice too. I like that big faux pearl. Yeah. And uh, nothing signed by anybody, no, right? No, that's, okay. that's why it's so weird. No, well, a lot of jewelry wasn't signed. Especially in the... This is Limoges. Nice. Does it say Limoges on the back? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, there it is. So this ought to be worth like 30 at least, right? I hope. Yeah, it's a really nice painted cam. This it's, one's marked on the shank print. here, so I assume it might be Cremens. Okay. It's a glass cameo. Okay. Reed thinks this is Cremens, is what she said. Uh, this is, I believe, a, a nice gold filled gold pin gold. with a pearl. I got like three pins. Okay. Are three gold filled ones? Or yeah, because I right? thought maybe a four screen so I could put them on as a lot. Yeah. See, I got, you know, pearl. Yeah, gold filled go jewelry uh, scraps and at a silver. similar amount to sterling. Uh, I don't know like, exactly. This is a hand, this is a painted uh, cameo. Oh, wow, that's nice. It says something on the back, too. Is that like Bavaria? It might have the lady's name on it. Oh, okay. It's, there. This, the, is this coin? That's really nice. Yeah, but you like those. The, the, it's a fine coral, but I don't know if those coins were just added onto a coral bracelet. I don't know. I and guess you just look up coral coin bracelet. Got. This one I got to look. There's something written on the side. I thought that one might be okay, but... Yeah, there's something written on the side there, and okay. I can't read it. All right, I'll take this. This, of course, is the but other gold pill pen. I don't know how many pieces are there, but I got it all for 100. Uh, you guys can count it and tell me. And, and this one, you it says nothing? Uh, no, but you can doesn't see it look, yeah, like it. I, I know. Like it. And this one is obviously nothing, it's just a B pin, not, not an actual B, the letter B. Uh, it, it could sting you though. Uh, and then this one, Marie says it says something on the shank, so I'll take a, I'll take a closer look at that. And maybe if I can figure it out. Maybe what I'll do is I'll try and take a picture of it and blow it up. You guys can see it. And once I start, once I start moving, okay, that's what we got.